A shooting at Mount Tabor, another gun found there, a gun at Parkland High, and now one at Paisley Middle School. It's leaving the community asking what can be done now to keep students safe. Winston-Salem Forsyth County School Superintendent Tricia McManus walking the halls of Parkland High School Wednesday. These visits are more honestly to get a pulse. Right now, the district is doing an assessment of school needs, but parents have been flooding the district's Facebook page, wanting something done now. How would change work? The superintendent can make temporary rules like clear bags at events, but the school board makes policy changes involving funding, which comes from the Board of Commissioners. The county commissioners in Forsyth County give the schools in this county $140 million a year. We give the sheriff's department, and I don't, I use the word give, we provide $80 million a year to the sheriff's department. And if need be, we give them additional monies for any type of emergency that comes up. We're doing that. Board Chair David Plyler says they are committed to stopping the violence. The school board, the commissioners, the sheriff's office, we're all together singing from the same songbook. Some parents have suggested a clear bag policy or metal detectors, which would require funding. But there's an agreement that change needs to happen, including from the district attorney. You know, we stand with the school system, we stand with, we stand with the superintendent, and we will do everything we can in our powers to be sure that people know and trust that the schools are going to be a safe place for, for kids to learn. And we did reach out to every member of the Board of Education via email and called the school board number to get their comment on the issue. We have not heard back.